do a review lesson today for our test, boys and girls. I will. I will. Apply what I have learned. Apply what I have learned. About expressions. About expressions. Equations. Equations. And patterns. And patterns. To solve problems. To solve problems. I will defend my answer. I will defend my answer. To my group. To my group. Using words, numbers, and pictures. Using words, numbers, and pictures. Okay, so we talked a lot about expressions, variables, and equations this lesson. Who remembers what an expression is? Who remembers what an expression is? Jill? Um, it's a problem with like, a letter in it. Like, five times five times five ten. Okay, all right. So it's a problem with a letter in it, but it doesn't have an equal sign, right? An equation is a sentence that contains an equal sign uh, showing that two expressions are equal. So 4 plus x equals 9. Do everybody remember that? Okay, and x is called a what? What is x called? Isaac? A variable. A variable. Very good. Okay, so today it says I'm going to defend my answer to my group using words, numbers, and pictures. Who can explain to me how I do that? How do I defend my answer to my group? Do I just yell out the answer I, I got? What do I do, Alex? You start from one, two, three, four, and you tell them and explain them what, like, what, how, what answer you got. Okay, so Yesenia's a one, Jay's a two, you're a three, and Ashlyn's a four. So does Ashlyn go first? No. no. Yesenia goes first, and does she just say, I got five? She has to explain her answer and show her work to you, right? So once you defend your answer and you're, um, somebody, three of you have it right and one of you has it wrong, what do you do? Alyssa? You, um, the other people have it right, you help the other one that got it wrong. So the three that got it right become the teacher and the one that got it wrong tries to figure out how to get it right. Correct? And then I'm going to have one of you stand up. I'll say all number two stand up and you'll rotate groups. And you'll explain to the next group how to do